When you approach the gas station pump, several different handles that indicate the fuel type are visible. The majority of the pumps are unleaded fuel pumps with various octane ratings and handles in various colors. Additionally, there is a handle for diesel fuel, which is typically green. But what happens if you mix up the pumps and put gas in a diesel engine? Spoiler, it can be a huge and costly problem. Let's take a closer look on it. Subscribe and let's get started. Diesel fuel is heavier than gasoline because its molecules are bigger. The variance in viscosity and density affects how atomization occurs. Additionally, compared to gasoline, it has a higher flash point and auto-ignition temperature. Unlike gasoline, diesel also has lubricating properties. Knowing this, it is possible to say the opposite about gasoline. With smaller molecules, it is lighter. Diesel has a lower flash point temperature than gasoline. Additionally, diesel doesn't evaporate like gasoline does. Instead of acting as a lubricant, gasoline functions more as a solvent. Can you put gas into a diesel engine? The diesel engine cannot run on gasoline, sorry. Diesel engines rely on compression to ignite the fuel instead of spark plugs. Therefore, proper combustion won't take place. In addition, once gasoline is circulated through the diesel system, significant harm may result. Gasoline cannot provide the proper lubrication that the diesel fuel system needs. Before resuming driving, the entire system must be cleaned and purged of the gasoline. Let's look at what happens if you put gas in a diesel engine. No lubrication. In order to maintain the system's components proper lubrication, diesel fuel is required. In contrast, gasoline lacks any lubricating qualities. Lack of lubrication can cause the metal parts to start rubbing against one another and causing friction. This issue causes the components of the fuel system to wear out abnormally. Uncontrollable detonation. Different ignition mechanisms are used in the combustion chambers of gas and diesel engines. You might notice a lot of black smoke coming from the tailpipe because the gas in the diesel tank doesn't completely burn. Detonation, which is an explosion of the fuel inside the cylinder, is another effect of the issue. Acceleration is the time when this knocking or pinging sound is most noticeable. Failing diesel pump. The fuel pump may be harmed by contamination from the gasoline. While gasoline serves as a solvent, diesel fuel acts as an oil. The pump will stop working if it doesn't have the proper lubrication. Given that a new diesel fuel pump can cost between $1,500 and $2,500, you don't want to harm this important component. Even if you could perform the repair yourself, you would still have to pay for the necessary parts. Stalling engine. The computer begins to adjust in order to make up for the incorrect timing of combustion and the ineffective use of the air-fuel mixture. Lack of power and poor performance are the outcomes. The situation may worsen to the point where the engine stalls. Additionally, the computer's sensors could get dirty and stop functioning properly. Failing fuel injectors. The injectors will malfunction for the same reason that the pump does. The injectors are vulnerable to excessive wear without the proper amount of lubrication. Damage won't take long to manifest itself. The cost of new fuel injectors can range from $350 to $850 each when that time comes. Severe engine damage. The engine will suffer severe damage, whether from a lack of lubrication or a rise in flash point temperature. The flash point of a full diesel tank can be lowered by 64 degrees Fahrenheit by adding even 1% of gasoline. Premature ignition is caused by this temperature change, and it will cause enormous damage. If you don't clear the system out quickly enough, you might have to consider buying a new engine. What to do if you put gas in a diesel engine? You need to act quickly if you accidentally put gasoline in your diesel engine. Here are some guidelines to remember. Never start the vehicle. If you've already started it, stop it and park it in a secure area. Make a tow truck call. Do not keep on driving your vehicle. Allow a mechanic to fix the car. Visit a diesel mechanic as soon as possible. Be patient because the repair may take some time and may be expensive. Even for experienced mechanics, this job calls for a high level of expertise. Because of this, we typically advise against doing it yourself. To completely remove all of the gasoline before using the car again, you would need to remove the fuel system's parts and drop the tank. Hope the information was useful for you. If so, please press the like button and subscribe to the channel.